team coverage turns now to local host Janine Stanwood outside the Kaseya Center with the reaction from the fans tonight. Janine. Well, this is definitely not the way that Heat fans wanted this night to end. Not only did they lose, I'm going to step out of the way, and you can see that it is flooded. People are walking on the street. It started pretty well, though. <laughs> nervous or confident? Confident. Nah, not even nervous. We got Jimmy Butler. Game four, only in Miami style. Yo, Boston fan, but you're a Heat fan. Come on, your girl ain't loyal, bro. On the streets, police are the cheerleaders. Got to take it. One, two, three. And the rivalry is on. Friends, yeah, friends, friends from school. school. Oh, no. And we're going to get Celtics in seven. Let's go. Yeah. No. They tried hard for four games. Yeah. But that's it. <laughs> Heat fans know how to bring the style and the bling. Hey, this Miami, mm -hmm. we got to do it big here in Miami all the time. Season seven. Season seven. Celtics fans are trying. Celtics fan. Chain. In their own way. He's originally from Boston, but we're, we live in Florida, yeah. Oh, you live in Florida, yeah, so that's yeah. why you're hiding your identity? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Police lining Biscayne Boulevard just in case celebrations break out. This night, for some fans, the Heat's house is the center of it all. We came all the way from Montreal to watch this game. You're visiting? Yeah. From Ukraine? From Ukraine. We came all the way out from Canada to watch this game. We love the Heat culture, the player development, the coach, everything about the franchise is amazing. So people can still love the Heat, but really not like what happened tonight, not only on the court, but what's happening outside of the arena. Once again, Biscayne Boulevard, a little flooded. People are kind of taking cover. Uh, there is lightning, there is thunder. Yeah, not a lot of happy fans here. But the good thing is there's another game on Thursday, so we'll stay tuned. We're in Miami. I'm Janine Sandwood, Local 10 News. Even Mother Nature is crying. All right, thank you. <laughs>